The mighty Missouri River looks calm, but looks can be deceiving. In Kansas City, it is the site for one of the largest boat races in the Midwest, the Missouri American Water MR340. Scott Mansker is the race director. This venue, uh, Kansas City, is one of the only spots where you could pull off a race of this magnitude where you have 500 boats staging for a start of a race. Um, that can only happen here where we've got some slack water and kind of a big harbor before you enter the, the very fast Missouri River. Every year in midsummer, racers meet at the Caw River to paddle from Kansas City to St. Charles, Missouri, traveling all day and into the night with the full moon to guide them. I mean, it's everything you can imagine. Canoes, kayaks, stand-up paddle boards, um, pedal-driven craft, uh, just anything human-powered. On October 21st, along with the nation, KC Water will participate in Imagine a Day Without Water, a day of advocacy and education about the value of water. KC Water uses the Missouri River as the source of our drinking water. We remove water from the river, treat it, clean it, and send it to homes, schools, and businesses all over Kansas City. Then we take the water that goes down the drain or toilet, clean it again and put it back into the river, cleaner than when it came out. We live in a great, amazing time where you can just turn a knob in your house and water comes out clean. Delicious water will come straight into your house and it wasn't always that way. And it's, it's, not, it's not like that everywhere in the world. It's not even like that everywhere in the United States. I mean, we're lucky that we have that here. So, I mean, a day without water for me just feels like a lot of anxiety, and a lot of struggle just to, to meet basic needs. Imagining a day without the river? Uh, that would be rough for the MR340 for sure. <laughs> for Casey Water, I'm Heather Frierson.